helpful to be quite open about his disability. Is that right? Yeah, he said once his employer discovered that he had a human personality, he was far more able to accept that sometimes he made mistakes and came to work tired. <laughs> now, Tony, I want you to feel too ashamed of this disorder. Yes, you're mentally unwell. You're sick, quite broken. People will probably call you mental. But so are many celebrities. Oh, it's very likely. <laughs> so is there anything else we should know? Well, I have a list of reading material in which I can email you, and it's always good to build more wellness tools and supports in his life. But don't treat Jamie any differently. Oh. <laughs> Thanks, Doctor. It just kind of helps just knowing there's a name for it. You know? You're welcome. You'd be quite surprised how the awareness of your condition can give yourself a bit more of a break when things get tough. Well, that's probably all we have time to cover today. So, make sure you stop by the receptionist and make another appointment, won't you? Thanks, Doctor. No worries, Jamie. It's gonna be okay, Mrs. It's gonna be alright. Um, Doctor? Ah, uh, yes, Mrs. Sutton. Look, some of the stuff that you were saying before, uh, about the money and uh, the stuff that happened when you were younger and the fears of death. Yes, Mrs. Sutton. Look, some of it sounded, um... Look, well, some of it sounded a bit like me. Well, these things can run in the families. You probably need some treatment as well. Oh, of course you'd need a book and pay for another consultation. But I wouldn't worry too much. Mental health issues, they're pretty common. <laughs>